Super Bowl cake to a party and they told us to wear our favorite team jersey and I don't really have a favorite team, but my son does and he loves, loves, loves the Eagles. This year they are not in the Super Bowl, but that's okay. We are going to be okay because we are going to make a football cake that you can bring to your party whether it's a football party for your kids football team or the Super Bowl, I'm going to show you a simple way so you can get out of the kitchen and watch the game, which I actually absolutely love doing. I love watching football, even though I don't have a favorite team. Hmm, fancy that. I kind of always root for the underdog. So let's start by showing you that all you really need for this is some buttercream and some mint green color. Save a little bit of white frosting for our lines on our cake and then a bag of Tootsie Rolls. I've just bought these little midget Tootsie Rolls. We're gonna put them all together and roll it out to make a football. All right, let's get started. All right, first of all, what you're gonna do is you're gonna unwrap as many of the Tootsie Rolls. I think I have about 15 here. That's going to make one football, but I'm actually gonna make two footballs that are gonna go on my cake. I went ahead and tinted my buttercream recipe, which I will link down below in the description box below and let you know that I put some mint green, but you can add any color green to make your grass. And then you can already see here, I made some lines of the markers for the downs, the 10, 20, 30, 40, 50s, all the way, and then after you hit 50, you have to go 40 the other way. And then I wanted to show you that I made a little template of a football shape. If you don't know how to freehand that, then just go ahead and find a picture or download a template from Google, just clip, type in football, clip art, black and white, and it will give you a template that you can print and then cut. But I wanted to show you that if you do not have disposable decorating bags, go ahead and just get a freezer, Ziploc bag, or any brand of bag, and you just to reinforce it, you wanna take some tape, and you wanna put it at the corner like this on one side. Now, when you cut a hole like that, it's not gonna make a perfect circle. So what you wanna do is open it up and fold it this way so that the crease is showing towards you. And then you can do another little piece of tape to reinforce it. And then you're ready to cut your hole. So you can cut a little hole like this and that will make a circle which will help you do the writing. Of course, if you have a disposable decorating bag, that'll make it a little bit easier. And actually, if you have tips, using a three or four, number three or four tip would even be easier. But I wanna show you the simple way, so that's why I'm using the bag, because I know a lot of you can't just go out and buy supplies when you're trying to do a cake quickly. So let me show you how to make the football. What you're gonna do is you're gonna zap these uh, Tootsie Rolls in the microwave for about five seconds. We're gonna roll it out with a roller. You can use a fondant roller or a pastry roller or a pie crust roller. And then we're going to lay this on and we're going to cut it out. Let me show you how to do that. All right, I'm rolling out my Tootsie Roll and I'm lifting it up every few times so that I can make sure it doesn't stick to my platform. I don't want to add any flour or cornstarch or anything because I don't want to change the color. But it looks kind of like chocolate fondant, which you could actually buy if you want to. I need a little bit bigger. Um, but this bag of Tootsie Rolls was about two bucks. And of course in the United States, but in other countries it might be a little different. But fondant would be five times that. So we're on a budget, right? All right, so now I wanna make sure I can fit two templates in, which I can. So I'm gonna use just a pizza cutter here to go around. And don't worry if you don't get the perfect lines because you can shape it with your hand when you're all done. And I'm gonna do two here. One and two. Lay that down. Wow, that just fit, huh? <laughs> And then don't throw your leftovers away because you're gonna need this for underneath our football. And I'll show you how we're gonna do that. All right, I'm gonna show you how to make the lines using my bag that I put some uh, white buttercream in, which I'll put the buttercream recipe. You're just gonna basically 
push with one hand, kind of squeezing the tip, and then using your index finger of your other hand, make that as your guide because you're trying to make straight lines. It doesn't have to be perfect, but you know, we're just practicing. And then again down here, sometimes it's a little harder to do it down below. You could bring the cake a little bit closer to you. And then you're just going to write the numbers like a football field. All right, let me show you how to make our football. So we cut out our footballs using a knife or a pizza cutter. And then with the leftover Tootsie Rolls, I just heated them up for about five seconds and then made a um, like a shape of a football. But I'm gonna be actually putting that underneath the football like this, like that, so that when I lay it on the cake and then press down, it makes a 3D effect, okay? So again, I'm gonna place this on here. Like that, and get the other side. Like this, and place that right there. And now I have two footballs, which I can write the teams that are in the Super Bowl or I can write Super Bowl, go team, whatever you want, okay? And then using the white, you're going to make the sides of the football. Like this. And then if you're going to write on the football, then you want the threads to be on the top. This is actually a fun cake. Be really a really super fun surprise for anybody that's a big football player and then you show up with this cake. All right, let me finish this up and we will show you what it looks like when we're all done. Our cake is almost done. I took a fork and I'm making some grass. I thought it would give it a little bit more texture to the cake. Just take a fork and flick it up upwards to make it look like the footballs are laying on the turf. And I hope you have a fun time at your football party and or just giving this to your favorite football fan. And thank you for joining us and we will see you next time.